Hi everybody, it's Janice. I'm here to share with you my Mother's Day gifts. Um, I made these using the Teresa Collins Tell Your Story collection as well as I used my Bind It All. No, not the Bind It All. The Cinch machine. I don't like the Bind It All. I love the Cinch. It's really easy to use. It really is a cinch. <laughs> um, let me just share this one first. I have a box that I got at the Goodwill. This one's for my stepmom. She loves twall. So I got this for like $2. And here is the little album. This is how I'm going to give it to her. I don't have to mail hers. So that's good. And just hand it to her. And I just made it really fun and with lots of little dangly things. The scene finding the twine came in the set as well as all this paper and stickers and these little banners. The pearls and the bling were in my stash. And then um, it came with all these stickers and stuff like that. And then I also used some Heidi Swap stamps. And then this was a set, a stamp and die set that I got from my friend Robin for Christmas. And then this is that Heidi Swap speech bubble. This is just a cuddle bug die that I have that makes little tags. I'm just going to go quickly through this. I made this embellishment here with plastic from packaging, store packaging. I die cut it with that Heidi Swap speech bubble and then I stamped it with stays on. That was the best, the best ink for that. I tried a bunch of others and they didn't work. They didn't dry. Even um, archival ink, it just never really dried. I, eventually, I was able to just smear it off, smear it off, even after like an hour. So, and then I've got a little treat bag from Michaels. I got it on clearance after Christmas. And a little tag in there, and some of that seam binding. And that's also Heidi Swap dye and stamp. Okay, so that's my stepmom's book, and it has this little kit in it that you can make your own flowers. So I did that. The sequins was from my stash, and then the pearl was from my stash, and so was this little key. I, I got that at the expo last year. I didn't go this year. And then this is the doily that I got also from Michaels. So very cute and feminine. other ones are pretty much similar. The only thing that's different about some of them is that I used scraps of paper and because of that, um, let's see, let me just zoom in a little bit here. Because I used scraps, um, I was able to get all these fun um, different irregular size pages. See that? And that's really fun. I even added a sequence to that little tag there. So I love the way this book turned out. And I hope that they enjoy it and know that I made it with love. And there's another one of those little embellishments. And that is a baby seahorse. You have to see this. So cute. Look at him. So I think I'm going to make another one for my sister that is of our cruise and I have another Teresa Collins paper set that's like a travel but it has a, a nautical feel to it so I'm going to try that next maybe, oh, sorry, <laughs> I'm figuring out this, I'm using the video recording feature on my iPhone, just like just the regular video, not the capture from YouTube. Some of you say you can't really hear me with that, so I'm trying this and see how it works out. I've tried a few other apps and they crash on me, so, because they're free, you know, I don't want to pay for them. So let's see how this one turns out.
I'm not talking super loud. Um, so we'll see how this works. Thanks for watching. Thanks for all the thumbs up and thanks for the comments. I, I read all the comments. So please leave a comment and enjoy. Thanks for watching. Bye.